Hi everybody, it's the Soap Man and it's time to cut the spin swirl soap I made yesterday. It's already out of the mold. Of course, it's already in the sections because I put the sectioning tool in it so I didn't have to pre-cut it. So what I'm going to do now is just turn it on the side and cut into it so we can see the inside. Let's get started. trimming is needed just where it sort of overflowed in areas with the sectioning or the yeah the sectioning tool but bottom line is it's pretty much ready so here we go you're going to see it with me for the first time just right in the center straight down Oh yeah, well, very nice. I like this pattern as well, this color scheme. Very nice. I just love this pour. This is one of my favorites. I'd consider doing a spin swirl with this, and I don't know, something I kind of chickened out, I guess. And I really should have, because that was a nice thin batter. It would have worked great with a spin swirl. So let's do another one. Yeah, very nice. Getting a few drag lines in the tie docks, but that's all right. We're just not going to worry about it. Very, very nice. This is the center one where the pouring tool was, and then I poured it out, it ended up like that. So this one's going to be distinctly different from the rest of them, always is. Except for the smear line there with the tie, tie docks, but oh, that is so neat. <coughs> I might see later on when this sets up a little bit if I can clean those 
smear lines up. I generally don't have that happen, and normally, this is neat on both sides, really neat on both sides, normally my titanium dioxide doesn't do that. It's mixed well enough, but oh well. Let me trim this one up just a little bit. final one. There we have it. Okay, so this is, got an 18 out of that, and then, of course, the last batch I made. Let me show you here what we have. Let's open these up a little bit and let them, so you can see them better. So there we have it. Those are the two in the center that had their very, very unique swirl to it. So use this same color scheme for the one I did a couple of weeks ago, which is this one. And that is, I think, 12 bars. So I will give those out as well as those at the same time because I'm cutting them thicker since starting January. I'm just doing this once a week. I'll probably only be making soap two, possibly three times a week. So I won't be here every single week, but I'll be here at least every other week. But anyway, that's what I have. This is my final soap for 2018. So I just want to wish all of you a very blessed, a very peaceful, a very joyful Merry Christmas to all my Christian friends, all of my Jewish friends. I do know Hanukkah is over. But I do hope that you had a wonderful time with your family and friends. I hope you had a wonderful, peaceful, joyful Hanukkah. And to everybody, thanks for watching. I will see you next year, and God bless. Bye.